Hi, this is the Cool Geek, and in this fifth video of the VLOOKUP series, we are going to learn how to use the VLOOKUP function with dynamic table using a name manager. If you want to learn about VLOOKUP with multiple columns, please do watch our third and fourth video of this series. Now, in this example, we have a table which is dynamic in nature. Uh, it means that we can add employees whenever time progresses. On the right hand side, we have another table where we do the VLOOKUP and get the details, salary, age and location. Now, to do this dynamically, what you need to do is select ABCD, go to the name box and type a name for this table. I will like, I'll type my EMP table and press enter. Pressing enter is important, then only the name gets created. To ensure the name is created, you can click the small arrow here and see that EMP, my MP table is present. If you select that, it should select the table here. Also, if you go to the formulas tab and click on name manager, it should be available here. You can see that the, the name my EMP table refers to column A to D. Now to do the VLOOKUP, what you can simply do is so we look up now look up value is Bob I'm going to fix the column of Bob leave the row as it is the table array now how uh, how we can choose it is saying my table my EMP table it will be present within the drop down here you can select that and it beautifully selects the whole table for us comma column index number is going to be used using a column function is going to select column and select salary close the bracket comma false that is exact match since we want to match the name press enter and you'll be able to get the salary com and age location for all of them i'm just going to fill it without formatting now uh, the beautiful part of this VLOOKUP trick is whenever you add another employee such as Jack the details of him start coming up automatically so let's say we'll add a salary for him enter his age and let's say he's from Chicago enter so now as and when when you start populating these this master table your table or lookup can be automatically done by this particular formula please ensure that you select all the columns while you're naming your table range so that whenever you add the rows here your VLOOKUP function is able to track them